starting in 5 seconds the value of education lies not just in getting a degree or training for a job the real value is in giving back to society and in helping those less privileged and less fortunate than us it is with this sentiment that guru nanak college has extended a special facility in partnership with an ngo that runs a school for special children that is children with special needs i am told that certificate courses are offered to such students to help them find employment and to promote mainstreaming i wish such efforts all success your college also strives to inculcate service to society and make students socially responsible following the december 2015 floods in chennai i have learned that our team from guru nanak college was one of the first to reach people in distress and provide food water medicines and other essentials the university of madras has both benefited from and contributed to a tradition of scholarship that is central to tamil nadu's identity even ordinary families in the state emphasize the value of education this has had a direct impact on social development indices and on the economy tamil nadu has a proud culture of research and innovation whether in the pure sciences or in medicine and of engineering and manufacturing it has a well regarded it sector and a growing digital economy these are complemented by excellence in the humanities it is no surprise that the tamil language is among the most ancient in the world centuries before many others it was exploring the literature and philosophy of learning the ability to pursue education as an end in itself as well as to help fill gaps in day to day lives of our fellow citizens in commendable in this context the people of tamil nadu and institutions such as the university of madras are a model for our country inevitably it is to institutions such as these that we turn for direction and leadership at the beginning of the 21st century this is an exciting chapter for india we are looking to become a developed society and to urgently eliminating poverty as well as ensuring health care education housing and energy access for all our people simultaneously our country is seeking to meet the opportunities as well as the challenges of the fourth industrial revolution of robotics genomics and artificial agencies intelligences universities such as this one are expected to be our navigators on this journey institutions in tamil nadu have shown commendable agility 
in nurturing an ecosystem that helps engineers and other qualified young people to become entrepreneurs and job creators this is the route to the future and this is the pathway for the youth of our country this convocation and this anniversary are a moment of renewal for both the university of madras and for those graduating today for the university the 160th anniversary is a point at which to reflect as to where you wish to be in 40 years when you commemorate your bicentenary the university needs to aspire to the next level to benchmark itself against the best in the world and to continue to remain competitive for top students as well as top faculty the government of india has announced a program to promote excellence in higher education by building capacities of 20 institutions of eminence i am told that the university of madras has prepared an ambitious and detailed plan in this regard and i wish you all the best please also build networks of your impressive and globally dispersed alumni and involve them in actionable proposals to upgrade the university its system and its scholarship this attribute has helped it stay contemporary and relevant to emerging needs of students and of society the range of courses and subjects offered here symbolizes this and spans the traditional liberal arts to 21st century disciplines history and economics are taught here and so are anthropology and religious studies and today this university has room for among other bioinformatics and nano science etc and to the students who are graduating today i can only say that you are entering a world teeming with opportunities you have been fortunate to have experienced education in a university of such standing not everybody has this privilege as you leave this campus carry your learning with humanity in some manner or in any manner you choose give back to society and to those who are less well off let that be the true test of your education i am happy to be with the cream of our cinema industry for the 65th national film awards ceremony i must begin the by congratulating each of the 125 award winners as well as the countless artists who i have have worked on the films that are being recognized today this is a special moment for all of you and india stop